after the events of The Last of Us Part 2, one wonders where Ellie's story might go in light of rumors that The Last of Us Part 3 is in the works. It would not be shocking if Ellie's journey came to an end in the next installment of a series that deals with so much loss and sorrow. Even though it's sad, this might be advantageous for the franchise's overall story. It would not come as a huge surprise to learn that the rumors of a The Last of Us Part 2 successor are true given how much attention Naughty Dog has recently given to The Last of Us. Fans of The Last of Us Part 1 can anticipate the upcoming PC port as well as the HBO adaptation, which will premiere in early 2023. Fans may learn new information about The Last of Us's world while the series stays true to its inspiration. Ellie's narrative has ended. Many characters in video games can remain active for many years, and during adventure after adventure. This holds true for all franchises created by Naughty Dog, including the titular, unstoppable hero of Crash Bandicoot. The Last of Us, however, makes an effort to incorporate realism into its frequently action-packed Hollywood-esque aesthetic. Characters must deal with the results of their decisions regardless of how long it takes for their deeds to catch up to them, and even beloved characters like Joel are susceptible to untimely death. Since gamers could watch Ellie grow up and eventually start a family with Dina, a lot of fans have developed strong attachments to her. Ellie has a similar trait to Joel in that she is forgiving, but she also makes a lot of mistakes because of this trait. When she is focused on a single objective, all those who stand in her way are just obstacles that need to be removed as she travels through the paths of vicious factions. In the end, Joel made the mistake of resorting to brutality in order to survive, which made him more enemies than he could handle. With all the dead bodies that lie in her past, Ellie might very well end up in the same situation. In the world of The Last of Us, Ellie would eventually have to answer for all of her deeds because that is just how things work. However, events don't have to come to the same bloody conclusion that Joel did, which also elevated Abby to the status of a formidable antagonist before she switched to being the deuteragonist in The Last of Us Part Two. Ellie's tale might be one of self-sacrifice and redemption. The Last of Us 3 would feel much more appropriate if Ellie's story ended in a way that allowed her to mend her relationship with Dina and find closure regarding all the loss she had experienced rather than having it go on indefinitely, which would feel less realistic. Switching between characters is a strength of The Last of Us. Players have control over a few characters throughout the entire series. In the first game, it starts out being Sarah, but quickly switches to Joel, and then briefly to Ellie. With the ability to control Joel, Ellie, and Abby at various points throughout the game, the Last of Us Part II continues this trend. These character changes are significant, advance the plot, and each character feels sufficiently distinct from the others to further increase immersion. There would be more character switching if Ellie's story was concluded. The majority of the characters appear prepared to pick up the series' baton. This is the best part. The series may focus on JJ, the son of Dina and Jesse, or it may continue to follow Abby and Lev as they look for the Fireflies. Even though The Last of Us Part 3 rumors haven't been officially confirmed, the idea of a potential third installment in the series does bring up a lot of concerns. In addition to providing many answers, The Last of Us Part 2 gave players new things to ponder. A third game might shed light on how humanity will ultimately fare after the outbreak. But it might also coincidentally bring Ellie's story to an end. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe and support my channel.